What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Hey, my sun seeds. I hope everyone is doing well. Thank you to all my subscribers. If you're new, welcome, welcome. Hit the bell button at the bottom so you can get a notification when I upload. I love you, sun seeds. I love you, I love you, I love you. I'm back to give you guys a reading. Sun seeds, if you guys are doubting yourself, stop, spirit is saying, stop doubting yourself. Okay? Stop doubting yourself. Anything that you set your mind to do, you can do. Okay? If you feel alone at this current moment, spirit has said you're not alone. You got your spirit, your spirit guides, your angels, your ancestors, they all watching over you. You're not alone. It may feel like that in a physical, but you're not. The world card. Spirit says cycles are just, you know, cycles are ending. The spirit is saying, stop doubting yourself. You're not going to know all the answers. Stop feeling like you need to know all the answers. You don't have to know all the answers. Okay? Spirit said, whatever you set your mind to do, you can do it. You may feel alone on a physical, but you're not alone. Trust me. They watch you and they guiding you. Okay, I just want to pull a few cards. Oh, I don't know what that's Okay. We got the Queen of Cups. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Queen of Wands. They just want you to nurture yourself. Getting that Queen of Wands energy, that passion, fiery. Seven of Swords. You could be doubting yourself because of some type of betray you. Some type of lie that you experienced before with somebody. And they left you with doubt. Making you doubt yourself. Spirit said you are good enough, Sunseed. You are more than enough. Whoever that person was, they were just in your life to teach you a lesson. Okay? Spirit said you are a very nurturing person. You're very nurturing. Spirit just want you to get back in that Queen of Wands energy, that fiery. Okay? That confidence. Don't let what somebody did to you in the past make you feel... I see the Nine of Cups trying to come out. Make you feel like you unworthy and mess with your confidence. The tower. That's why you guys could be feeling alone right now. You guys could have just experienced a tower moment. You just probably found out about some backstabbing, backstabbing, lying, or some type of betray you. Some type of secrets that was hidden from you. So you guys experienced a tower moment from somebody who you trusted. Who you love, who you care about. You found out some type of secrets. But Spirit is saying, we had to bring the tower moment. Because we had to bring this tower moment down. Because that person was only there to teach you a lesson. A spiritual lesson. That person backstabbed you. They, they, they lied to you over and over. Yeah, they juggled you. Spirit is saying, whoever this person is, they had you an illusion. They had you thinking and being hopeful that it could be more than what they were showing you. But Spirit said they had secrets. They was lying to you. So Spirit had to bring the tower moment to it down to expose this person. And if you haven't already experienced, this is what's, this is what's happening. Holy oh, Spirit. Page of Pentacles. Spirit said you're about to receive new offers, new beginnings. Okay. Spirit clear for the same one. Yeah, somebody broke your heart. Three of Swords. Somebody broke your heart. I'm feeling like they had you in some type of illusion. 
somebody from the past backstab you, betrays you, they lied to you. With this tower, you found out something. Something was unleashed to you. Could have found out this person was juggling you. This person was giving you false hope. This person could have thinking had you thinking that it was just you. But you found out something. Whatever this tower is that came down, it broke your heart. It broke your heart. Spirit, clarify the seven of swords. Thank you, Spirit. Clarify the seven of swords. That's why I spirit, when I, I started off, Spirit says, if you doubting yourself, stop doubting yourself. Whoever this person was from the past, this person tried to sh like shatter your confidence because of this betrayal. But Spirit said, get in this Queen of Wands, get in this fiery energy. Get back here. This is where this is who you are. This person tried to dim your confidence. They tried to, they made they wanted you to feel unworthy. Spirit said you are worthy. Spirit said, whatever you set your mind to doing, you can do. This person tried to take that away from you. I see it. This person was juggling you. This person had a lot of secrets that was hidden. And with that towel, with that towel, Spirit had to bring it down so it could be revealed. But Spirit said, I got new office for you with this page of pentacles. Temperance. Spirit is going to bring you balance now. Justice. Because whoever you was dealing with. Could be a Capricorn. It was too much betrayal. And if it's not a lover, take it how it resonates. It could be a friend, family, lover. Flip-flop the rules. You know your story. This person backstabbed somebody from your past. Somebody who you was in a union with. Knight of Cups. They was love bombing you. This they was they was in and out your life. This somebody that comes and goes. This somebody had you thinking that it was only you, or giving you false hope. And with that tower moment, something was revealed about this Knight of Cups. The spirit said, "You are the star." You the star. Spirit wants you to walk away. That's why Spirit brought the tower moment down. Spirit wants you to walk away. Spirit said, come to the edge. Take a leap of faith. Okay? Spirit wants you to travel and move away from this person. A lot of you guys could be traveling soon. Two of Wands. Spirit wants you to move forward from this person. And Spirit felt the need to bring this tower moment to shake things up. Because whoever this person was, they were just holding you up. They were just holding you up. It was something that you needed to learn with this person, Spirit said. Spirit needs you to get into that Queen of Cups back to nurturing yourself. Spirit wants you to bring the fire back with that Queen of Wands. Whoever have you doubting yourself is all illusion. This person wanted you to feel that way. It was all illusion. This purpose, this person was been juggling you, Spirit said. They was in and out your life, coming and acting like they want to come in your life, being all charming, making it seem like it was just you. But Spirit said this person had somebody else, whether you knew it or not. Whoever this person from your past. Let me pull some more cards. I don't know why I'm feeling. I'm feeling like this person probably was doing some type of black magic. I'm feeling like it. Because I feel like this person had you on some type of illusion. They was backstabbing you, lying, betraying you. And you look like you had a, a lot of love for this person. You was very nurturing, caring, loving. Very beautiful. I see you as being very beautiful. Beautiful and nurturing. So loving. The type of love that you have is very is very motherly. A lot of you guys can have an old soul. 
But I seen you treat him as a devil. He took advantage of that. He seen that. Spirit is calling justice. This person don't even know who they is. And they tried to confuse you, Sunseed. That's why you doubting yourself. Spirit says, stop doubting yourself. You can do whatever you set your mind to. Spirit said, you're not alone. Spirit is right here. Your spirit guides, your angels, your ancestors, they over you. They protecting you. They always was here. Even when you was going through the tower moment, they was here. If you look and you see those butterflies and that lightning, you see that? They was always there. Look at them, all them orange butterflies. Your spirit guides was always here. They had to bring that tower moment because they needed you to see who this person was so you can move forward. So you could come to the edge and take a leap of faith. Stop doubting yourself. Spirit said you are the star. Okay? Whoever this person was from your past was lying to you. They was betraying you. And spirit had to expose it to bring you balance because you deserve it. Justice. Whoever this person is, they broke your heart. Whatever you found out about this tower, it broke your heart. They had you thinking they wanted this union with you. But this person was given to somewhere else. This Knight of Cups was in and out. This person had a lot of things hidden. Holy Spirit, give me some messages from my selfies. Thank you, Holy Spirit. And I have some messages from my friend. Spirit is needing you now. Spirit put this towel because Spirit wants you to go towards your life purpose. Whatever that is for you. And this person from your past was holding you up. This person was holding you up, lying to you, backstabbing you, betraying you. Spirit seen everything. This person had you an illusion, Sunseeds. They was holding you up. Holding you up, backstabbing you, lying, betraying you, giving you false hope. Spirit is wants you. Spirit made spirit put this tower down to, have, to move you towards your life purpose. Spirit knew with this person in the mix, with this energy right here, it was you, you, you was gonna take forever. Spirit said you was gonna take forever. Spirit brought this tower moment down to push you towards your life purpose. Finding your life purpose. Giving you time to be alone. Having this person out of your energy. Spirit said, access the nine. You private pop property. Spirit said, you mine. Your angels, your ancestors. Your spirit guide. They said, you mine. I refuse to let this go on any longer, they said. So they said, I'm bringing a tower moment down. I'm going to show you and reveal to you exactly what this person is. I'm surprised we didn't see the sun card, but I'm feeling like this person was just exposed. The tower moment is, is something crumbling down. Shit gets shaked the hell up. Spirit said, you private property. You mine. Spirit pushing you to your life purpose. That tower moment came down for you to focus on yourself. Spirit needed this person out your energy. I know it broke your heart, Sunseeds. I see it. This person broke your heart. The spirit is pushing you to move forward. And with this person in, around you, 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 it was going to take you forever. Spirit said this person was just in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson. Skeletons. Secrets are about to be revealed. What did I say? You found out something about this person and it shook your world. It shook your world, Sunseeds. Holy Spirit divine. Spirit got a new office for you, son. See, you just got to trust the process. Spirit is never, ever going to take something away from you without the intention on replacing it. And usually when spirit takes something away from you, it is, is, is no good. It's no good. Trust me, whatever spirit about the place in your life is going to be 10 times better than that. And what's better than walking into your life purpose? 
What's better than walking into your life purpose? You know how much this is this for me is wish fulfillment. Abundance. Yeah, you seeing through the fog. Now you experiencing a new new. Seeing things from a higher perspective. Purify. Spirit needed this person out your energy for you to purify your aura. You could not do that while you had this person around in your energy. Believing that whatever illusion that they had you under, thinking that it was something more than it wasn't. Spirit needed this person removed out your energy so you could purify your aura to get you focused on your life purpose. Because Spirit said, this person has secrets and they were revealed to you. Spirit said, you about to go through a level up. It's a level up now. I just said, whatever spirit took out your life, trust me, you about to get, it's something about to come through that's going to be 10 times better than that. And I do not want you to ignore your feelings. I know this hurt you. Acknowledge that this hurt you. Just don't stand, don't stay in that. Acknowledge your feelings. Say, I know this hurt. I'm a hell. Call on Archangel Raphael. And go and, and go towards your purpose. My motto is turn that pain into passion. Those blessings into lessons. I stand on that. Take all that pain and turn that shit into passion. So I see. Give me some more messages, Holy Spirit. That's where the miracles rely. To make some beautiful things out of pain. Yeah, self-reflect. Take a moment to reflect. This person tried to project their negative energy onto you. And spirit knew that. This person tried to project their energy onto you. They wanted to keep you in illusion. Spirit wanted you to purify yourself. This person will come back wanting an apology. Spirit said no. Because the whole time this person was lying to you, behind your back, they was lying. This person has addictions, sex addictions, drug addictions. Whoever this person was, they they dealing with trauma. That's why they try to hurt you like that. That's why they try to keep you in illusion. This person is selfish. Tarot reading. You could be a reader. Or you could be get, or or this person could be getting readings done on you, and this person probably didn't want to let you go because this person knew that you are leveling up. They knew they was juggling you, they knew what it was, but this person wanted to keep you an illusion and make you think that they really wanted to be with you because they knew that you was leveling up as far as your money. Spirit seen that. That's why spirit bring that tower down. I told you, I know it might sound, feel hard, you know, feel bad right now, but you just look at that town, you see all those butterflies? Your spirit guides, your angels, they was guiding you. They Listen, I didn't mean to say guiding you. They was always there. You're not alone. If you feel alone right now, some seeds, you're not. Your spirit guides, your angels, your ancestors are there. When this tower moment came down, or if it hadn't already, Trust me, your angels, your ancestors, your guys, they're all there. Okay? The spirit said you was going the wrong way. This person was not who you thought they were. That's why spirit had to reveal the skeletons. Okay? This person, secrets are about to be revealed. They are not who you thought they are. This person is juggling you, trying to keep you in an, an illusion. Because they know that you're coming into money. And spirit is seeing that. Projection. Your life has a projection of the energy you are putting out. I said that whoever this person is, they was trying to project their negative energy on you. That's why if you somewhere having doubt right now, spirit is saying stop doubting yourself. You are more than enough. You're more than enough. You're nurturing. You're loving. You're kind. Anybody that come in contact with you, that, that's the type of person you are. Spirit is saying you're beautiful, you're victorious. 
You got that look about you. Wherever you go, you turn heads. Because that's just who you are. And when you open your mouth, you're so loving. You're so nurturing. You're the whole package, son. See? If I'm talking to my guys, you're the same way. You know there's no gender in tarot. But this person wanted to wanted to um, reflect their energy and project their energy on you, which is this. So it can leave you in doubt. But Spirit said, stop doubting yourself. Anything you want, ooh, excuse me, anything you want, you can have. All you got to do is put your mind to it. You're not going to know all the answers. So if you sit up here worrying about why this person did this and why they was lying or why this person mistreated me, Spirit said, no. Stop, stop, stop trying to know all the answers. Just trust the process. Spirit said, trust the process. I, I did this. Because I need you on your life purpose. Okay? I need you to prayerify. Spirit said, I need you to prayerify your energy. That's why I brought this tower down. Trust the process. You're not alone. The whole time, your angels, your ancestors, your guides was right there. You're not alone. Okay? Anything else, Holy Spirit? Anything else? Oh, anything else, Holy Spirit? Anything else on the spirit? Astral travel. You may be having out-of-body experience. A lot of you guys are going through a spiritual awakening. And with this spiritual awakening, I'm just going to let you guys know. There's a lot of people that's going to be taking out your life that does not serve you well. Whether you want to see it, believe it, or not. Your angels, your spirit guides, your ancestors, they see everything. They know everything that goes on behind the scenes. And when you're on this spiritual path, anybody that's not for your highest good or not for you, spirit is going to bring a tower moment and shake things up and remove them. Because they don't mean you no good. I'm telling you, a lot of you guys are going through a spiritual awakening. And spirit don't have no problem with terminating them. Taking them right up on out of here. If you was getting the signs... And spirit was showing you that this person was a was a night, an in and out person, not somebody to be trusted, full of bullshit. Spirit will still say, I will give you a chance. I will give you a chance to do what you know to do. And if you don't, spirit will bring this tower on you. And when this tower comes, it's gonna come through. I'm telling you, it's gonna it's gonna make you, you know, wish that you did do it. Because I I could feel y'all, I could feel this energy. Somebody is hurt. Hurt. But baby, trust the process. It was for your highest good. Spirit had to terminate this person. Okay? You were stuck in the past. But this person was not who you thought they were. Okay? You're going to be manifesting. Manifesting. You're going through a spiritual awakening. Trust the process. Get to work. You are the gift. Stop doubting yourself. You are the gift. You are worthy. You're more than enough. With this queen of cups and this queen of wands, you fiery. You beautiful. You beautiful. You victorious. I mean, everything about you on the outside is so beautiful. And then with the queen of cups, it lets me know that your outer match your inner. You're not just beautiful on the outside. You have a loving, passionate heart. You care about anybody you come in contact with. You're always helping people. You're helpful. You're nurturing. You're beautiful on the inside and out. Spirit said you are the gift. That's why I took you away. But where I'm guiding you, you're going to be happy that I did that. Spirit had to dead something. Spirit had to end it. Spirit said, I had to end it because I love you so much. Stop thinking about what you lost and having doubt and trying to have answers of why this happened to me. Spirit said, look at it like I love you so much, baby. This is why I did it because this person was, was a sneak. Spirit said, you deserve balance. Spirit love you.
I love you. I love you. I love you, my sun seeds. I just want to come through, drop you guys the energy reading. Until next time, stay up the purest, highest white light. Okay? And remember, you more than enough. You more than enough. Stop doubting yourself and trust the process. Awakening is never easy. It's not all glamours and rainbows and stuff how people paint it to be. It's a process. And yes, sometimes it does hurt. But when you get to the other side, it's so beautiful. It's so loving. You're going to be thanking spirit. You're going to be thanking your angels divine that they did bring that tower down. Okay? I love you, sun seeds. Until next time. Mm -hmm.